Assalamu alaikum and welcome to Titli's Busy Kitchen with me, Titli Nihan. Today I'm going to cook a curry called achar merg or achar chicken. Now achar is an Urdu word which means pickle and should not be confused with a very similar sounding Urdu word achar which means very good. Although this is an achar achar merg. Confused yet? Why not? Miss Sanjine? For my achar merg I've got 500 grams of cubed chicken breast one grated onion, and I do wish I had a fume cupboard in my kitchen for just such a purpose. One tablespoon of garlic and ginger paste, 125 mils of plain yogurt, half a teaspoon each of chili powder and salt, and a quarter of a teaspoon of turmeric, half a teaspoon each of mustard seeds, cumin seeds, fennel seeds, fenugreek seeds, and kalonji, and two whole cloves, one tablespoon of lemon juice, half a teaspoon of sugar and four green chilies fresh from my greenhouse. Acha. First thing I'm going to do is take the chicken and add in the yogurt, the onion, the garlic and ginger paste and the turmeric, salt and chili powders. Then mix really well. When it's all nicely mixed, pop it in the fridge for 30 minutes to marinate. Now while your chicken's having a bath, take a pan, put it over a medium heat, don't add any oil, but add in the seeds and the cloves, and just toast these for about a minute. Mmm, awesome vapours. When the mustard seeds start to pop, you know it's time to stop. Now tip the seeds onto a piece of kitchen paper, fold it over once, twice, rice, flip over, and then with a rolling pin just crush them very lightly. Oh, I love that sound. If you've done this right, the seeds should be just very lightly crushed, that's nice. Now we'll just put these to one side. Then top the chilies and slip them down the middle. When your chicken's ready, heat four tablespoons of oil or ghee in the pan and add in the chicken. Now stir fry gently for about 15 minutes to cook the chicken. After about 15 minutes or so, you'll start to see it catch on the bottom of the pan. Don't worry, just give it a scrape, keep stirring. This is the onion in your mixture starting to caramelise. Oh, you can see all that lovely stickiness on the bottom of the pan, look. So now what I'm going to do is add in a quarter of a cup of water, the lemon juice, the sugar, and your achar masala that you've made. Mix them all together. See how it brings the stickiness off the bottom of the pan really easily? Now add on the chilies, cover, and cook gently for about five minutes. After about five minutes, take off the lid. It's quite possible you might need to add just a little bit more liquid back into the mixture. That's fine. Another quarter of a cup of water. Mix, bring to the boil, and serve. A charmerg. There's only one word you could ever use to describe this. A char. So if you want people to say that your achar merg is achar, then use this recipe. TK. Join me next time in Tiddly's Busy Kitchen with me, Tiddly Han. Until next time, Khuda Hafiz.